So that's the first time I've cut through the webbing with the chainsaw. I actually did pretty good. I had the multi-tool here to, to cut through it if I needed, but actually that did pretty good. But it's brand new, sharp blade, worked pretty good. So what, <clears throat> what I do, or what we learned to do, is you have to secure an electrical box. So I'm using this style with a flange on it. And if I put it right up against the webbing, then I can screw hmm. right to the webbing. And that holds it in place. But you gotta get all the foam out. And the multi tool with a two and a half inch wide blade seems to work the best that I've found so far. Pretty much just put it sideways. Get it in there. And just the pressure of the foam holds it in place. They use just kind of a blunt object. Not too sharp. It'll slide right back in there. All the way back to the concrete. That's probably a little too tight of a radius of bend. So here's probably what I would suggest doing. So then it doesn't kink as much. I think something like that's a little bit better. A little tricky getting past the webbing, but once you get past there, it's not too bad. Cut off this excess. There we have it. Well, I think, you know, you're gonna see more and more of these ICF buildings going up. It's just another way of building. So to learn how to actually wire them is not that hard. It's just different. So, you know, it's practice makes perfect. So the more experience you get at it, I think just like anything, the better and the faster you get at it. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed what you saw, be sure to like and subscribe. To watch the next video, click on the link here.